Hello there, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the second episode of, well, Eastern Pali Guest Flow Management. And in today's video, we are going to look into what has been changed recently in the park and what we still have to fix in terms of guest flow. Um, I really appreciate how much you guys liked the first episode of this format. So um, also sorry that I couldn't release that on Monday. Uh, various reasons led to this fact, um, but I, I, I have already told you in the uh, Monday stream, so yeah, I'm a little bit sorry that it doesn't work, but um, yeah, it was just because I had to, so much to do with my new flat, or with our new flat, I should say. Uh, we were quite busy in uh, bringing together all the various uh, people involved and um, also needed to go shopping for it um, to make sure that our workers have enough of material and so on. So yeah, in the end, that kind of worked. Well, as um, promised last time, I kept the park running for a few minutes already, so now we can check a little bit better um, how the restaurant areas work. And um, what I feel is really good, even though we can't really prove that at the moment entirely, since, as you can see, there is barely anyone in here. Which is a little bit weird, to be honest, uh, but I got the suggestion that we should create rosters. And I guess this is a good idea to make sure at least that we have some vendors in here. So what we're going to do is we're going to put now a few new employees down in this area and we're going to put them into a roster only working in this area. And since we have, I think, three and another three shops um, and one janitor, maybe we should put in... 10 staff members and well 10 might be a bit too much uh, in you know maybe let's say eight and a janitor just in this area so this is why we need to pause the game over here and we go into our staff uh, environment and I don't really know how many of those normal people we have but again it uh, seems that nearly everyone left the park which is yeah which is weird. I guess they always leave the park when once it's not open, and you know they're just um, always. Uh, you know, we, I'm, I'm not complaining. So I thought eight. Um, since we should do that, it is like four, five, uh, six, seven, eight, and also a janitor. Boom. Yeah, there we go. Okay, let's first of all take a wait. I need to let them fall down first of all so I can choose them great uh, first things first we're gonna train them okay we can't train them now but we can put this to 250 I guess and we create a new roaster and um, this new roaster will be I think just about this area I think this is just about right and we create this one and this is the beach restaurant oops there we go um, this should be pretty much it, I guess. So we just save this one. And this is the beach restaurant. I guess this, okay, game saves as well. Um, over 10 minutes running already. Anyways, we just, cr wait, why didn't that work? Um, okay, what's going, to, what's going on here? Game, hello, game. So, oh, hello. Whoa, what, what, what was that? That was just a major lag. So, um, I don't know why this didn't work. So anyways, um, hmm, let's do that again. So I want to have this whole area covered, right. And we create this and call it a beach restaurant. There we go, safe. Ah, there we go, now we can choose it. Okay, I have no idea why this doesn't, this, this doesn't work, um, but now it does. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna repaint him, and for this beach restaurant, I'm gonna put into this color, I think this is a nicer color. Um, he's going to get some brownish uh, hand shoes, um, or gloves, I should say, that's the that's the right word. Is, it, is hand shoes also a word for English? I guess not, right, it's gloves. I'm pretty sure it is gloves. And I want to have like more greenish um, of these boots. So here we go. This is Leveren earring, and you know what? This is I don't know. I'm just I'm just putting this down. This is Mr. Jack now. I'm putting down a few names. Uh, if I you know not every of them, but a few of them. Um, just putting in your name. So keep on commenting on all the videos. So I potentially gonna put you in as well. Also putting down Harry Cooper here already. Uh, that's great. Um, oh, that's a girl. So I should put down um, Zabellina. There we go. I, she's missing for a while, by the way. Anyways, she's in the beach restaurant as well. And this is going to be a... 
what kind of like darkish green color and I want to have this more of a brownish color yes that's great cool this is done Sabaline is done then we go into is this a guy Leopold yeah Leopoldo this is Leopoldo Carnes the good uh, the good old meat man um, oh that's called okay I think it's Pita Maniac oops Pita Maniac plus that's like the bigger version of him uh, if we go with uh, the Apple logic so anyways uh, why can't I okay this is super unhandy are you kidding me okay I'm 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 going to use some pre-made things then honestly okay that's super weird um, okay but this should be green right yeah never mind I, I'm not going to repaint all of them then oh this is this is a shame why can't I just use like okay we, we just use these two ish things over here and that should be fine um, name for this one oh gosh all these names this is like the lady now um, without a designer and beach restaurant still done great uh, we put this in obviously as mr. Fain wait uh, not sailor oh we forget to put in the sailor gosh uh, beach restaurant uh, green 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 oh yeah I can't see that okay green there we go this is like darkish um, and this is mr. Fain night Fain and I there we go and we put the salary on all of them higher. Hopefully that they're gonna stay in the park then, I don't know. Can I just choose this one, please? Thank you. 250 bucks and 250 bucks here. And we're gonna do the same with uh, Bo Marit. And this is going to be the beach restaurant again, like a darker color, greener color. There we go, beach restaurant's fine. And 250, great. This is going to be the beach restaurant again. This is 250. And this is Chante Goodman. Is it Goodman? I guess so. I, I, I believe it is right, but I'm, I'm not entirely sure. Uh, wait, I forgot the colors. Um, the, the hairs are fitting, right? So we're gonna put this in um, for her. So this is, uh, I, I was just, you know, I was just seeing the hairs and I was like, okay, this, this could be good. Uh, wait, this is not the hairs. What was that the trousers? Okay, let's reset them and put in the hairs and just like Wait, these should be the hairs though, shouldn't they? Um, wait, what what did I just recolor? Are these the boots? Ah, I can't recolor the hairs. What a pity. Anyways, um, another guy over here. This is Mr. Edgy Spread, obviously. And I'm gonna put in 250 and the beach restaurant and getting sorry this color and a little bit of a more greenish color in here great and whoops that's this is um wait first of all 250 beach restaurant and dark and green huh? now there was a reason wait a second am i completely dumped now However, um, and this is, this is, you know what, this is, this is, this is, this is, um, um, should I stay or should I go? Uh, let me just have a little look in here. Um, I am, I'm searching for a specific name, there we go. This is a Jamo. I don't know why, but the hairs are just fitting for Jamo. I have no idea why, but what can I add here? Preferred sh shop assessment. Um, and then I can, can I choose this shop then? Is this working? Great, confirm. Cool, uh, I'm not going to do this for all of them now, but uh, so this is good to know. Add a new roaster, it doesn't really matter because we have the, oh no, we put to, oh okay, this is better. Okay, we put to this one, so he's constantly changing these uh, various things over here. And you know what, we're going back to her and we're going to change Sabaline's chart. Okay, I will have to look at the video again because I'm pretty sure that the recent tab in the color options wasn't here before. I'm, I'm quite sure it wasn't. I, I can't be that blind. 
Was I? I? I don't know. I don't know. Anyways, let's put the game on play again. Okay, people are roaming in. I hope that this will at least fix a little bit the issue of not having shops over there because, um, yeah, this would be very unfortunate if we wouldn't have any any problems here, but um, or like any any staff members here. So I think the same goes for this area over over here. We don't have anyone in here, right? So I don't know. We don't need that many people in this area. I mean, we are just putting some down now. But um, I don't want to bother you the whole episode with only putting people down. So I think three should be fine. And you know what? There is no need for gender. We keep them in this kind of color. We create a new roaster. And this is the entrance roaster. Which should be this area. There we go. And this is the entrance. Oh damn, I've never done this before and actually it's really cool that the game offers this kind of management system which you barely ever need, which is a which is really a shame, it has a lot of good things. I mean, if you really would need to do that to keep the game running, it would be great, but at some point you, you can just pump in a million staff members and, you know, the problem will fix itself. Um, but this is not exactly how you should do this. Um, also, you can't, you know, in campaign mode, you obviously can't just give them all like uh, 250 bucks a month. This would make you uh, quickly uh, bankrupt, which uh, is not the best thing to do. Uh, okay, this is like again entrance, and the last one is entrance 250. We still need to rename these people, but we're gonna do this next time. Okay, so cool. This has been done, this has been done. I don't really know if people need to go into the. What, are they queuing up for the restaurant? What are they doing? Like, uh. Left hand empty. I've been robbed. What, when did that happen? Okay, this is. I'm surprised there's no gift shop in the park. Okay, we need some more gift shop. You know what? We do have a gift shop, but there is no one employed, right? Um, but I guess we only have one gift shop. Is that true? Which should be this one, but obviously there's no one in here. Um, this is maybe something we really need to focus on. We have no specific gift shop in here. Like we we have the information desk over here, which seems to be pretty like. Do people not find the way to go or what's exactly happening? What well, we do have a gift shop. This is a gift shop over here. This is obviously a gift shop. Um, wait, no, there we go. Okay, I can't really change this one right now. Anyways, uh, so this seems to work. This is fine. This is super awesome. Okay, let's let's check again if there are any other issues. I feel like after a time, uh, this area has to um, has fixed it itself, which is great. We were struggling quite a bit last time, but um, it seems that this works out pretty well. Like re. Uh, locating the entrance really did the magic so that this all works a lot better. Um, I still haven't found a proper fix to uh, some of the other issues once it's going to go uh, more and more crowded in here. This is still an issue but I can't really fix this. Um, however, this, dim this thing over here still needs to be um, finally done there are missing some you know shades and stuff above those people because they're pretty much melted at the moment <laughs> which is uh, not quite good in here um the go-kart track just works as it should work so we do have the entrance area it's obviously filled i mean later on once the park is completely done um i think we won't have the entire park filled but for the moment it really seems to be really good so we have these you know vents on top of the um, of, of this little shed over here like they're getting a little bit of free air in uh, these little kids are still happy in the queue they're waiting for the go-karts they're pretty much uh, looking forward to it um, I could put in though um, wait is it auto-saving again obviously yes gosh it's always auto-saving at least it feels like um, what we can do though is oh come on game please don't do this to me Please don't do this to me. That would be awesome. <sighs> Dang. I'm I'm so glad. I'm so super glad they are looking into this for the next um Oops, what's going on here? Oh, the screen is... Um, okay, anyways. Uh, okay. Uh, I'm so happy that the next update will obviously be um, focused on making the whole menu quicker and stuff because it's barely playable at the moment and yeah, I think they pretty much got our feedback so this is great. Um, this is what I wanted to do, yes, okay. So we need to rotate that freaking thing around. Why is the angle snap not activated? However, I just do that, boom. Here we go with some card action and wait. There we go and we put down, I think this should be the other way, wait. 
Oh, it's it's both wrong. Okay, anyways, um, let's do this and now, hello, and do that. And now we can just rotate this little bit over here. Great, done. I mean, this is also great for these little episodes um, in real time where you can fix these little tiny bits and pieces. Um, again, as also um, promised, we do have to put some helmets on here. They are not entirely done in the TMT yet, so I have to check uh, check that. But yeah, the um, little briefing room is done, which I also like quite a bit. Um, she's still standing a little bit lonely over here. Maybe I'm going to change this a tiny bit, but from, for the moment that should be still fine. I love that people start using this area over here a bit more. Maybe we put some more benches in here. You know what? Let me just quickly do this. Well, quickly is like a little bit of a thing. Um, with the menu. Oh gosh, look at that. Look at that. By the way, the cool thing is I'm still like I'm having uh, around 4,000 people in the park right now and um, the good thing about uh, this is the performance still is pretty okay. I'm running like full 30 FPS, like pretty constant. Uh, I mean, except these, these weird uh, moments. Uh, ah, okay, this is why I didn't put any here. I, I wish I can... You know what, I want to put this bench somewhere. I feel like a little bit of variation would help the whole thing. I'm going to use this one and I'm going to make this way darker and this like a more less saturated brownish tint. Yeah, that's what I like. Yeah, there we go. This is nice and maybe we can have some more here. Just a little bit of variation in here. Great. Maybe um, one bin, one more bin. This one. I like these quite a bit if they... Uh, this doesn't really work the way I hoped it would. I don't want to put this like somewhere in, in, in no man's land, right? This is just like not... I think this is nice. Let's put this one here and that one here. Great. Cool. So this has been done. Um, there are still a few lanterns missing. I'm gonna do this later. Uh, we could... Can we, can we put the... Can we find this this way? I don't know if so, but keep... Uh, it's not really... It's like... Staff, sign, staff, it's not staff, it's uh, sign. Okay, what do we have like in here? Neon, neon, neon? Nope, that's not what I wanted. Needs to be another one. Letter A, letter I, letter K, letter U, letter W. We have like red eyed, uh, right sign, Rudy sign, blah, 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 blah. I need to be safety, safety, no entry sign. Yeah, that's what I, that's what I need. That's what I need. This has to go here. Boom. One. And then we have like uh, safety equipment. Yes, but we can change the color of this one into this. And there needs to be one more sign for um, stuff only. Where is that one? Ah, there we go. This is here. So wait. Okay, that's somehow... Okay, this is moving weirdly. But anyways, we, uh, we should be able to do this. Like put that in here. Here we go. Done! Great! Cool! So that's about it. Um, whoops, I didn't want to do that. Uh, anyways, I, I, I think I want to do this. Um, because this is already the end of this short update. Um, as you can see, we actually fixed a lot of issues. Um, we, I don't know if this was in last episode or if I did this uh, off screen or just in the stream. I don't remember. But we fixed this problem over here by putting these barriers in. It's a little bit finicky. People just get a little bit blocking in here. Or they, they just get blocked in here. But the problem was that this area was way too crowded. Now, as we change it this way it's still a little bit you know uh, it's it's not perfect but it's a lot better than it was before because we kept the flow over here running there's no issue at all and uh, people are queuing up on this hand side they are not going in here or there and uh, so that's it um, I mean it will be way better in the end once it all uh, comes to a better situation once the park is more crowded obviously but also more spread out yeah you can really see what's happening if this area is crowded same issue as for the other ones we definitely have to get in with more um, possibilities to get some food because obviously this is the only area working right now no one is going here which is still weird because I, I have this thing put here anyways um, yeah well it's just a shipping container you can watch here oops I didn't want to do that um, Let's go back into this view. So yeah, this is pretty crowded here. Um, 
we do have to find a solution to improve this. Um, obviously also put some more bins here, make sure that our janitor is always in here and yeah, I mean that's that's about it. Uh, also put down more opportunities to get some food. I don't know, do people use the restaurant by now? They don't really do this. Is it open though? Or is it not big enough? Or what, what, what's the problem with you? I do want to know what the problem is. Let me just check. So restaurant, there's like no one in here. Great. Um, Customers last month, 55. I think I have to upgrade the whole thing to make more ex expansions of this one and make it make it a lot more interesting for people uh, to go in here. I, I think I have to look into this next episode, but as I said, this will be for next episode. So for now, uh, this is uh, all I can show you. Well, this is the coaster I've showed you last time. Um, but here's a little thing. If you have watched this episode carefully, um, I don't know how carefully you watch it, but you may have seen some spoilers. Uh, I don't want to talk about what I have shown you secretly in this episode without actually pointing at it. But um, for those of you with eagle eyes, you will have potentially seen that, um, which will be in the next two episodes of the time lapse, because I'm recording this later than the time lapses. Uh, but anyhow, so make sure to stay tuned for those ones, because you will see some some long awaited things. And I know because I built some of it in the live stream on Monday, people are very pleased with it and uh, yeah I'm hoping that most of you are still pleased with it and also I'm preparing the billboards tonight so don't worry I haven't forgot about you um, they will be also hopefully dropping the weekend and yeah you're gonna see then more of it in the next episodes but until then stay tight and have a great time until the next episode and bye bye